Storm Ida has unleashed flash flooding and tornadoes across the northeast of the U.S., killing dozens and causing devastation in a number of states. New York City and New Jersey have been hit by unprecedented levels of rainfall, with residents left trapped in flooded basements and cars. Tornadoes, spawned by the storm, ripped off roofs and sent debris thousands of feet into the air. Satellite images taken by Maxa on Thursday showed large areas of New Jersey submerged, with business and homes devastated by flood water. The rising waters reached a baseball stadium in Bridgewater, home to the Somerset Patriots. The city of New Brunswick in New Jersey was also badly hit. Memorial Parkway and key roads on the banks of the Raritan River were completely inundated. Large areas of Manville, New Jersey, were also completely inaccessible. Flooding prevented emergency vehicles from reaching properties on fire. A tornado ripped apart homes in the New Jersey neighborhood of Milker Hill, with high winds tearing off roofs and walls. Residents described how it took just seconds for homes to be destroyed. The latest destruction caused by the storm, the fifth strongest to ever hit the U.S. mainland, follows widespread flooding of communities in Louisiana and Mississippi. Earlier this week, Ada's remnants brought six to eight inches of rain to large areas or the northeast, including New York. The National Weather Service said it set an hourly rainfall record of 3.15 inches for Manhattan, breaking one set by tropical storm under less than two weeks ago. Weather mapping from the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration shows the wide band of heavy rain, which hit the area between 1 and 2 September. New York Governor Kathy Hochul described a Niagara Falls level of water. U.S. President Joe Biden has now declared an emergency in both New Jersey and New York, enabling both states to receive federal funding to support local disaster relief efforts. Ida arrived in New Orleans on 29 August, 2016 years after Hurricane Katrina followed a similar path in 2005, killing 1,800 people. Thank you for watching. Please, subscribe.